Yeah. I... <laughs> yeah, you have a beautiful background. Do you want me to move it or something? Uh, I don't really mind. Um... I can sit this way, I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I just don't want you to, uh, to have like a mess up, mess up uh, background. Don't worry, I'll try it. It's okay, like I can move anyway. It's going to be like convenient for you. Oh, this is nice. I can hide your forehead. Hide my forehead? Yeah, hello. Or are this you hiding it with my fringe? This is a episode <laughs> of Come on, Speak Out and I'm in Narnia. You may not know where Narnia Welcome. is. That's Victoria's personal space. Uh, yes. And yeah. That's my new personal space. So, I've come here. Why? Because Victoria is a model. She's an inspiration to a lot of students, but they won't admit it. So here I just want to ask, <laughs> Victoria, how is London City? Living in Bradford. Oh, it's very expensive. That's, <laughs> that's the first thing I tell anyone. It's very expensive, but it's so much fun. There's a lot of things to do. Um, so you never get bored. So, of course, there's a lot of stuff you can do for free, which I'm uh, most of the time enjoying to, you know, um, not to uh, go, get, like, go bankrupt. Uh, but yeah, it's amazing. It's very really like this place. And I've, like, yes, comparing to Bradford, there's much more stuff to do. Um, I feel like there's less nature kind of there, because in, in Bradford, you could just like five minutes each way and you can go hiking, something, something, um, parks and everything. Of course, in London, there's a lot of parks, but still, um, it's quite far to get to any like bigger nature, let's say. And parks are usually just grass, few, dre few trees, and that's it. <laughs> so I'm like, well, not too much nature. So how is adapting? How is living? It's going well. Mm -hmm. It's going well. I'm very busy with my uni. I can imagine. So that's probably like most of my time. Uh, yeah, but I'm still getting like the... Regular, I'm doing regular things I used to do. So I go to the gym, I go swimming, I, I started volleyball as well. Hey. They do have one in the sports center next to us. Are you president? So, no, 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 it's a, it's a private club. It's a okay. private club open for kids, teenagers and then adults. Um, so, so it's like more just, you know, for playing for fun, organizing some activities for, for, you know, for teenagers. We have too much of an overachiever. They're oh. going to outshine everyone and they're just going to feel insecure. You know? No, no, no. Mm -hmm. I, I don't think so. Mm -hmm. I've, you know, I, I've met a lot of very, um, hardworking people at my uni or like, you know, for friends. Um, so I think that, you know, there's quite a lot of people who, who, do actually more than I do. <gasps> I'm serious. And I'm like, I admire those people. <gasps> I'm just like, I go and I'm like, yeah, tell me what you do this weekend. Like, did you study? Did you work? Did you travel? Like, you know, stuff like that. And of course, everyone has like, you know, their own experience and, and things they're doing. Uh, but it's always nice to hear like, um, what people, you know, are doing with their lives. So, yes. It's happy to hear. I'm here. You're, I'm happy to just see you. I don't know, progressing, still have the smile on my face, of which course. I told you. Oh, come on, that's like, a, that's like a classic, it's always going to be there. Mm -hmm. Good you found people you have impressed you. Oh yes, no. yes I did. Yeah, I met, um, I met a few students, um, so to, to, like, to draw a little bit of background, um, as a law student uh, we are aiming to get a training contract in a law firm that will allow us to like, qualify fully as a lawyer. Um, and then we can work by ourselves and everything. Um, so, if, like, I don't have a training contract yet. I did apply for a few schemes, but I didn't get through. Um, but I do. I did meet a lot of people who already have the contract and the firm paid for the training as well, like did the course I'm doing right now. So this is a huge thing. Some of those students um, didn't even study law. Uh, they studied something else, then they thought maybe it's worth a try. So they did like a qualification, like one year to, you know, um, qualify that to like, like to, to, to get closer to, to legal profession. And then they applied to the law firm. They liked them for having different backgrounds, from having different knowledge and abilities. They got a contract and now they're, they're at uni with me. So they are amazing. I, I know how much um, work they have to put in because the firms also look at the results, see how, you know, how they're doing, are they actually good and everything. So that's that's great. 
and I aim to like get to those firms as well because um, some of my friends are in like huge firms um, and I'm just like okay so do you have any you know advice what can I do what would be interesting for the firm um, that I can you know learn or like read more about so it's very nice I feel very motivated um, and I think that's the most important right now to, to be motivated and like continue that hard work just like in different place. Okay, thinking positively, when you yeah. get into this firm, how long do you plan to spend? Um, so firm? once I get to the firm, I have to be there for two years for the contract. Mm. And some of the firms like to sign a contract that I will stay there for a few more years. Uh, some of them are like, yeah, do whatever you want, like, we, we trained you, it would be nice if you stay, if you, you know, if you're gonna leave, that's fine. Um, but yeah, I feel like first I need to get to the training contract and then I'll, I'm gonna think, think about the rest. Because that's, I think, quite a quite difficult part right now um, to get in, um, even with having all qualifications, like finishing master's and, um, and the legal practice course I'm doing right now, sometimes it still takes a few years to, to get in. So yeah, slowly, you know, building up, you know, one step at a time. But that's that's how it is. Everything. But how about you? Because okay. I want to know what's what's happening with you. Okay. <laughs> um just because this is for you, give some time. One, two, three. Okay. Um 